Hi. Welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome in. I got my little apron on today, y'all. Y'all see it? Queen of the kitchen. It's Justine. <laughs> oh, one of my lovely supporters sent me this. Her name is Kendra. Uh-oh. Yeah, one of my um, lovely supporters sent me this. Queen of the kitchen. Don't play with it. Hold on, let me get it tied up right. Y'all see that queen of the kitchen? It, it's kind of like, I don't know, it just don't fit me right. I think the strap, I need to do something maybe with the strap or something. Child. Hey, what's up? I need, you need my advice. Okay. Look at me giving advice. <laughs> You want to tell me now, or can I make a quick drink? Can I make a quick drink? <laughs> let me make a let me make a quick drink, okay? Let me let, let me get ready for whatever you about to ask. <laughs> I gotta be prepared. Hey, what's up, um, Brooklyn? Welcome. Hi, Justina Chess. Switching in the kitchen. Listen, I'm in the kitchen doing my little thing today. Y'all like my little apron? I've been had it for a long time. I just Never used it, but I'm using it now, okay? Welcome, wait a while. Before you say something, let me grab a drink. Ooh, it is hot in here. I'm not gonna lie, it's hot. I feel like I'm about to pass. I ain't gonna lie. And the weasel go pop. What y'all talking about? Hey, Meek. Welcome. Hey, Paula. Make your drink. And I'm about to dash my drink. I, I cooked already. Okay. Okay. We have a rum chata. We're going to play this back. We're going to play this back from yesterday. Rum chata and fireball. I need y'all to like the live as y'all come on in. I'm cooking today because I need to be putting some on my stomach before I start drinking. Knowing damn well I'm going to be sick as hell. You know what? I think we're going to, I ain't going to lie. What's the degrees up in here? Because I ain't got my phone. You might have to, um, I ain't going to lie. You might have to turn the air on. Because I can't be in here sweating and, and acting fool. What's the temperature on? I'll tell you what to put it on. Ooh, yeah. Give me a nice little drinky drink. I don't know about y'all. I don't know what y'all. Y'all drinking water? Don't forget your water. Let me grab my water. Don't forget your water. I got my water. Got my water. Well, Y'all ready for the weekend? Y'all ready? Y'all know what this weekend is? Huh? Do y'all know what this weekend is? I don't know what the weekend is. I just thought maybe y'all knew. I'm going to have a drink with you. Hey, Ronnie. But I will have my drink as soon as I walk in the door. Okay. Hey, Francis. Hey, Justine from Delaware. Hey. Hello, uh, Bath Sheba. Hey, Bath Sheba. Hey, welcome. Uh, I have to work, but I don't know if I'm going. Girl, no, you're not trying to call in. I feel you though, because baby, I be, <laughs> I know it. I, I'll call in in a minute. I'll be like, uh, man, I feel like I ain't got to go in yet. Shit. I got some sick leave. <laughs> That's how I be thinking. 
I got some sick leave. <laughs> Ooh, I ain't gotta go. Mm. Okay, it's hitting. It's hitting. Y'all, today we are gonna be making. I know y'all gonna be wondering what we could. Hey, y'all, please like the live as you come in. Thank you. Today, wow, ball, you are not playing. Fireball, yeah. I ain't playing. I got fireball today, baby. Uh, fireball and rum chata. I'll keep it in the background so y'all know what's on today's menu. So, uh, <laughs> um, we got fireball and rum chata. I'm mixing. I make. I'm making this drink called French toast. Okay. Thumbs up the live, please. And if you just came in, please consider subscribing. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, it's good. Hey, um, Travia. Hey, Justine. I got green grapes sojo solo and cast beer. Let's get it. <laughs> What's cast beer? I wonder what kind of beer that is. I never had that before. Hey, y'all, today I'm making salmon bowls. This is my very first time making salmon bowls, so let's see how I go, okay? I got this vision in my head, trying to eat healthy, even though I shouldn't be drinking, but hey, we're having a good time. It's the, it's the beginning of the weekend. Um, hey, Miss Gloria. Hey, Justina Chad. Happy Friday. Happy Friday. Who got paid today? Who, who got paid today? Some people get paid every week. Some people get paid every two weeks. Uh, she loves you, and she's one of your biggest fans. Who? Hi, Justine. Can you say hi to my girlfriend, Tanika? Hi, Tanika. Welcome. Hey, Tanika. How you doing? Welcome. I'm about to sip on some Taylor Port. What's Taylor Port? Justin, I had to run and buy me a new bottle already. Oh, me too. I went and got a bottle today. Look at this. <laughs> mm. But I'm going to be sick as a dog if I don't get the cooking. I'm going to be sick as a dog. Anyways, I made some oatmeal this morning. I got up and made some oatmeal and just some scrambled eggs. And I wonder, do I need this damn pot I made the oatmeal in? I didn't think to warm up some beans. Well, I ain't gonna worry about that now. What I need to be worrying about is seasoning the salmon, right? You need to cut it up. I gotta cut it up. Okay, let me grab the salmon out the refrigerator. I feel like a chef. <laughs> I feel like a chef on live TV. Um. Hey, um, Harlan. Hey, welcome. I just, what you cooking? I'm making a salmon bowl. So here is my salmon. I'm gonna uh, wash it real quick. Let me wash, I gotta wash my hands, but let me get my, cut, let me get my cutting board. Okay, this is my, I'm gonna season it and put it on here. I'm gonna wash it, put it on here, season it, and cut it up. And I hope don't nothing fall in the sink. Okay. Well, it sounds good. I'm trying to eat healthy, y'all. Gotta lose some weight. Gotta lose some weight. Let me wash my hands. Salmon bowl sounds delicious. I'm trying, I'm trying to be, be better. Um. Congratulations on your new house. Thank you, Justin. Teleport is wine. Oh, I never knew that. I never knew that. Ooh. Look at this fat daddy. Fat daddy salmon. Let me turn around. It looks it's looking good. Let me get it off. Juan has something. She wants to ask me something. So, as soon as I get this nice rinse, 
I gotta skin this thing, don't I? It's not even easy to skin salmon. How you skin salmon? Skin on. <laughs> 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 I know this. Oh, what is? Sounds like your mental health is a lot better. It sure is. When you get it right, oh, I think I could peel it off. I think I found. I don't know if I can peel it off my hands. I got to cut it off. When you um, eliminate people out of your life that don't mean you good, don't mean you any good, then, yeah, your mental start being better. You ain't got nobody to be talking crazy to you all the time. Mm -mm. Damn, how do you skin the salmon? It's good with steak, the red wine. I didn't know that. What? Hey, Justine. Hey, Te Tequila. Hey, how you doing? Thank you for stopping by. Hey, Justine. Stop in to say hi. Hey, Angel Eyes. Hello, and hit the like button, everyone. Have a great live. Happy cooking. All right. See you later, girl. Um... I made homemade cream potato soup. What? That sounds good. Sounds really good. Hold on, y'all. I'm trying to peel the... the what am I trying to do? I'm trying to peel the damn salmon with my hands. Happy jewelry and crafts. Did you hear that? Yes! Um, I got your package. I opened it last night um, on my vlog, but... I didn't tell nobody on the live what you sent me. But yes, it's in a video. I got it in a video coming up. And actually, somebody, um, if y'all don't know, this came from one of my supporters, Kendra. She sent me this apron. This was last year sometime I got this. And um, also somebody sent me lashes. And I got them on my eyes today. I believe it was... Uh, Melissa sent me lashes, and I got them on my eyes today, baby. I appreciate y'all so much. Y'all sent me some wonderful gifts, and I thank you guys so much. How do I give you a super sticker? Um, you hit that dollar sign. It should be like a dollar sign something on the chat. I need to put my cash app up there for people that want to support. Why is the knife? You think the knife is better? You like to try it. Okay, let me try Okay, my assistant is going to help me out. This is my assistant. And if anybody want to go and subscribe to his channel, go ahead and subscribe. He makes some good uh shorts cleaning y'all should who seen his cleaning shorts they are some really awesome videos and it's so soothing oh you're giving it to me i thought you was about to do it oh, you doing good. <laughs> i don't know what i'm doing sometimes but that's what i'm saying maybe flip it over and just... salmon is not like how you think it is it's it's a very like they said put hot water on it is a very delicate type, type thing. Who eats salmon raw? Yeah. I have ate it like raw at the sushi place. They season it right. <laughs> yeah, I got it, I got it. Um, I'm going to send you a gift song. Something nice for your new space. Okay. Okay. I look forward to it. Thank you. I look forward to it. I'm peeling it, y'all. I'm peeling it. Y'all see, I'm getting it done. If I know this, I would have peeled this shit a long time ago. <laughs> oh, it's coming, y'all. It's coming along. It's not really that bad, but I feel like it's taking away some light. Hey, Luan. Hey, Ronnie. Luan, don't ask your question yet. I'll let you know when I'm ready. 
Hey, MJ. Edwina, I live in Gilbert. Hopefully, I will run into you. I just love your channel and your vibe. Oh, thank you. Oh, I like Gilbert. Um, That's not where I go get my spa stuff. Thank you, Francis. Thank you for the super sticker. I like Gilbert and Chandler. Chandler and Gilbert is like, y'all right by each other, right? Okay, wait, wait a minute, I think I... Hold on, y'all. I'm getting it. I'm getting it, y'all. Y'all sent me some somebody. Well, ain't no somebody. Melissa sent me lashes. I got the lashes on, y'all. Um, I had to come down a little bit. You know you have to cut trim your lashes sometimes because to fit your eye. But actually, they seem really nice. They're not really dramatic. I think they're really nice. What y'all think? Okay, I gotta wash this, wash this again. Put all that skin and skull. What you call it, skull? Scab. What's it called, these little things that be on their skull? The scale. Scale. <laughs> ah! Ah! Get the scale. <laughs> oh, shit. I had to get the scale off of there. Oh, my God. Thank you, Lassie. Thank you. Please subscribe to his channel. Um, I would greatly appreciate it, and he would too. <laughs> but um, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Everybody, y'all. Sometimes, and let me just make it clear, because a lot of y'all know, but some y'all don't. I don't always pronounce things correctly. Um, I, I, you got to remember, my mama was from the South, and my daddy, he, he barely speak English. So I think I kind of picked up some miscommunicating type stuff. <laughs> you gotta, you gotta drink this. It's good. No, I'm saying I use a little bit for it. Oh, okay, okay, yeah. I'll drink it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they talk very different. You gotta, you gotta, I think you got one parent from Puerto Rico, one parent from Tennessee. Real southern. Real. My, father, my mother's real southern. A lot of people say I sound country. I've uh, never been, I mean, I've been to the country, but I'm not born from the country, okay? But they say I'm, I'm from the city, and they say I sound country. And then my father, he's from Puerto Rico. So I'm going to blame it on my parents. I don't care what nobody said. I'm blaming it on my parents. I don't care if I graduated, went to college. I don't care. I'm blaming it on my parents, okay? Yeah, I think you know what you yeah. You have both of their language. Exactly. <laughs> Shit. I mix. All right, y'all. I got it, I got the salmon skinned. Right now, I'm about to cut it in pieces, and then we're going to start seasoning it, okay? My son is going to help me with the air fryer because we're going to put these salmon little bits in the air fryer. Francis said that you speak Spanish. Um, I used to take up the language. I only know a little bit, of, a few words. Muy poquito. Muy poquito. Very little. Mucho. Mucho poquito. What's muy? Mucho very? is very. What's mucho? Mucho, very. very. <laughs> Mi casa. You know what casa is. Oh. Yeah. I was also the food tasting thing in AZ. That was good. I like that place. That what? Place. Foodie Land. She said she was there. Oh, you at the Foodie Land? Yo, I bless, man. Yo, poquito. Yo, po poquito. Whatever. <laughs> poquito. Muy. Muy. Oh, mucho. Muy. Muy. Muy, po 
poquito. No Spanish, you can say a, a word probably three, four times away. <laughs> Y'all don't use Spanish so much shit. It, I, I don't forget how to use it. <laughs> like when you start school and stuff, they try to teach you like the basic, like what's your name, and then you know how to ask somebody where to, you can. I learned like how you ask somebody where they're from. Those are like the basic kind of questions. So those kind of questions stick in my head when it comes to Spanish, but otherwise I'm not fluent in Spanish. Yes, I have a father. I mean, yes, I had a parent that was from Puerto Rico, born and raised. I think he came to the to the United States as a young man. But listen, we can't help who our parents are. Just just remember that. Can't help who our parents are. I'm really, I'm really thankful. I didn't grow up with no silver spoon in my mouth and no lavish lifestyle, but I'm very thankful because it helps me to appreciate things. And it makes me like want to strive for more, for better. So I'm very thankful for both of my parents. And I don't know. I can't say. I don't know what else to say. I just, I didn't have a, a lavish childhood lifestyle or nothing like that. But I had a pretty good lifestyle. I would say it was average. <laughs> it was average. I know it was still about a lot of things that like my kids know nothing about. We had record players, we had black and white TV, we had a floor model, we had telephone. My kids know about house phone. Y'all, you remember house phone, don't you? <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay, because I was like, we had house phone. I remember record players, you remember record Oh, you remember record player, okay. Yeah, so like some of the things growing up, you can appreciate, you know? I don't know where I got, I think how I, the, me wanting a lavish lifestyle and a luxury lifestyle and want all these uh, uh, material things, I could say, it didn't come from my parents. My parents are not like that. Let me just, they are not like that. I, I got the liking for these things by reading magazines. And when I seen people in magazines, and I saw what they were wearing. I grew a liking. I, I, baby, I didn't have no, no designer budget or nothing. I grew a liking to these things when I have nothing. When I had nothing, I knew about Gucci and Louis and never even owned a piece. And it came from um, reading magazines and, and books and stuff and, and fashion, trying to learn about fashion. That's where it came from. So people want to sit up there and criticize because I like these things. But I grew a liking to it because I thought it was nice. Growing up, when you don't have nothing and you tend to want more, you want things that you know you can't have, basically, you know? And that's where it came from. Am I mad about it? Hell no. Hell no, not one bit. You know, Celine, you know the singer Celine? The, the, the singer? You know the singer Celine? Selena? So, no, not Selena. Oh, Selena. Celine Dion. Dion. Yeah. yeah. Anyway, Celine Dion had uh, talked about like how her lifestyle was so she was so poor. She had very a lot of siblings. They were they they really had to wear their shoes down to the hose was you know till your shoes start talking. And I don't know. And then you become this person and. You become rich, and now you think about your childhood when you when you had to wear your, your shoes to a hole came in the bottom. So now you feel like I want to be able to own as many pair of shoes I want. Cause baby, I was I didn't have that when I was younger. I I didn't grow up like this. So you gotta remember, like, I, I hate when people talk about people things they have, but everybody didn't ain't become rich growing up rich. All these basketball players, football players, and they want to be in all these diamonds and stuff. And I understand because, baby, we grow up, we didn't grow up rich. We grew up poor. We, we want to enjoy 
the things that we, we could never had afford one time in life. But now when you can be able to afford things and you work hard towards it, you appreciate it and you enjoy it. And people tend to hate on that. I don't know why. Like you want to enjoy what you can while you can. You know what they say? Everybody die, but not everybody live. Baby, I'm living. I, ain't, I don't care what nobody say. I'm enjoying myself, and I'm a, I'm enjoying my hard works, period. All right? So, anyways, <laughs> let me see what y'all saying. I can't wait for the fairs. I started. I need an elephant ear. An elephant ear? I think that's something like a um, funnel cake, ain't it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hey, JoJo. I was watching it all live. I didn't know you had, you was on a new one. Happy to be here. Hey, JoJo, welcome. Look, y'all, I got the salmon all diced up and cut up. So now I'm going to start seasoning it. What do we season with? Y'all know when I cook, I, I include with y'all every step of the way. Huh? Oh, oh, he, oh got, he got some seasoning for me. Uh, oil. Oh, let me drizzle some oil. Okay. This is extra virgin olive oil. I don't have a label on there. I'm going to put a label. I'm going to put the label, and my, my other one is empty, but it's clean. I washed these already. I washed them with my hands, and I put them okay, in a dish. You drowned me. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It's a drizzle. I'm drowning. I like a lot of little pepper. I love pepper. Let me, let me tell y'all something. You'll never see me put salt on my food. Unless, you know, some french fries or something like that. I don't really cook with salt. You should, like, mix it up. Because you want the seasoning to stick to the, the oil. Yeah, don't I supposed to add oil? How I, you do I, it? I, I usually just drizzle, mix it up so oil can get saturated, then steam. Okay. Then I got to wash. This is like multiple washing my hands. Mm -hmm. Ooh, this, like, feels good. Salmon is soft. Yeah, you drown it. <laughs> it's okay. Y'all hear it? Y'all hear that? He's getting the air fryer started. Baby, this is this air fryer is the business. Do you see how big it is? This is my first time ever owning an air fryer. Look how big it is. And I won it in a raffle. Don't play with it. <laughs> I won it in a raffle. And did you ever look it up to see how much that um, air fryer was? I think so. I forgot. Was it like 300 or two something? I think it was 300. Mm -hmm. Girl, I got a good air fryer. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. So far, we cooked. He cooked some wings in there. Good. I have never used this air fryer. Let, let's just, I'm going to put my, because y'all y'all know I keep it real with y'all. I'm not going to lie and I ain't going to front, Okay. I never used this air fryer. My son, he he know how to operate it. He know how to use it. I won it. He just took over, okay? He made some chicken wings one time. They came out so good. You know, if, if he shows me, he'd be like, do you think this is done or you want it done longer? And I'd be like, cook it longer. <laughs> but he, when it happened, I'd be like, ooh, it was perfect. She like to overcook stuff. I don't overcook stuff. I want to make sure it's done. <laughs> Chicken, you gotta make sure it's done. Steak, um, you know, I don't mind a little pink. I don't want my steak bloody, but I don't mind a little pink. Okay, what temperature? We're gonna do like 400. 400 for like maybe eight to 10 minutes. They don't take, salmon don't take over. Okay, so the salmon is done, y'all. I'm gonna move, I'm gonna set this to the side for when the um, air fryer is done. I mean, when the air fryer is ready. Now what I'm going to concentrate. Take it off or no? What's I hear it still timer? going. What time is it? It says 400, four, five, four, oh, three, two, one. And then that little thing was in the dishwasher. Yeah, I'll put it in there. Oh, okay. This is crazy. <laughs> um, My daughter bought me an air fryer and I don't use it. it it's my kids do, do. I don't use it. My kids do in a blender. Yeah, me too. Like, I don't even know how to use it, girl. 
Um, okay, we answered the chimp. The Juju's girl I worked with told me I was spoiled. You spoiled? I like to hear that. I like the word spoil. <laughs> hey, I want somebody to spoil me. <laughs> Trust and believe. I don't want to spend my money. Okay? I want somebody else to spend their coins. <laughs> but right now, I'm single. I got I, I to gotta spend my coins. I, I got I to gotta spend my coins. Mm. Like the lie, like the lie. Like the lie, like the lie. Oh my God, we should be at, oh, it's over a hundred people. Can we please get a hundred likes? Even if you don't want to say anything, because I know a lot of y'all don't like to sit back and just watch, and that's fine, but please like the live. That's, a, that's, the, least, that's the least I ask for, okay? Um, anyways, this live today, uh, because one of my supporters, I believe it was Ronnie, Ronnie was like, go live tomorrow. Go live and do a, a Ram Chata in Fireball party or get together, whatever you want to call it. And baby, that's the reason why we're here. I swear, y'all love, y'all are loving these lives. When I put out a vlog, y'all on the vlog tell us to go live. <laughs> I'm glad that y'all are loving these lives. I feel like I, I haven't went as live as much. As I am now, you know. <laughs> but y'all enjoying it. I thank y'all. Put them in while the thing is. Okay, so I thought you was going to do it. You want me to do uh, it? You just, you just chef. Okay, so I'm the chef. So I got to do what I got to do. So what you do? You just pull this out and then do what? Put them in there. <laughs> you just, I, yeah, I can turn it back on. Once you're doing do you just like space it apart? Just I just throw them all in there and shake up the basket. Look at this, a scub. A scale, dude. A scale. Throw them all, just dump them in here. I don't want to. And then dump. just shake the basket of it. They spread out. Okay. But like spread them out. When you throw them in. Okay. This is, oh, this is going in there! <laughs> <laughs> this is going in there! Y'all, my kids know they got a crazy mama, okay? This might be new to y'all, but this definitely ain't new to them. Hey, sexy 30. Hey, Carlotta. Hey, Carlotta. Hey, sexy. This is my kids used to the way I'm at. And I remember one, one time my rich put on her video. She said, y'all think my mama be putting on my, this is the way my mama is. <laughs> my kids used to it. Y'all not used to it. Okay. <laughs> I'm loud, baby. I'm loud. I be acting the fool. That's what, I gotta meet. I gotta meet a man that can match my vibe. You want me to show you how to do it? Yeah, you want to show me real it's quick? Simple. It's only it's really one button. Man. Okay, wait a second. Let me. Okay, show me how to do it. Look, all you do is temperature, so it'll be both in. Okay. And then you push the temperature button again and change the time. So we're gonna do like let's do like six. Why would you do, do it that low? Let's do three. Cause we're gonna we're gonna um, shake them up halfway through. Oh, and it lights up. It lights up. Yeah. So when I go out, we shake them up. Then you know, it lights up so I can see what, how it's looking. Yes, yes, yes. This is amazing technology, baby. <laughs> technology is a MF, okay? <laughs> God damn. I'm shocked. All right, so what do you think? Hey, guys, can we get a vote? Should we have black, black eye, black eye peas? Lord Jesus. I do a poll. Okay, do a poll. <laughs> Should we make the, let's do a poll. Yes. Why do we both? That's what I'm asking. them. So we have pinto beans, black beans, or both. Do the poll. We, we got, we want to, we want to type, we want to liven up the live, y'all, to make it interesting for y'all. So I hope y'all enjoying this. I hope y'all do. We're going to do polls. Uh, right now, we got it on subscriber mode, because I hope whoever joined the live will subscribe. Cheers, guys, to a Friday evening. Mm. They said both. Pinto. Do the, hey, can y'all um, please um, do the poll? Anyways, y'all. Both, both is winning. <laughs> hey, y'all, look at these nails. I haven't got my nails done yet because remember, I had that, um, that bad experience at the nail shop. 
where the lady was drilling my nails. Every every single nail got drilled, baby. I was in pain for days. I was basically holding my hand like this and trying to do stuff. I was like, my hand hurts so bad for days. Y'all, I'm traumatized. <laughs> and I want my nails done so bad. Can you see the pole? Yeah, I can see the pole. Right now, both is winning. Both is winning? Okay, let's give it a couple more minutes. Hey, y'all, please like the live. We're almost at 100 likes. Uh, I'm Creole, and we have red beans and rice. I love some red beans and rice. I love that. I started to make uh, jambalaya with shrimp and sausage today, or shrimp and chicken. What she do? She door dashed it. You door dashed the one because she said she was going to do something. I'm used to. I'm used to my kids. What she say? I'm used to my kids say my mouth is lethal. Let me tell you something. Like my mouth can get a little, you know, something too. Let me tell you something. When I get upset, I will snap. I I gotta. I can cuss y'all. Don't play with it. That's why I don't like to be mad and upset. But when I get upset, I sure can. Period. <laughs> okay. 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 So let's see what the votes say. Y'all got y'all drink. Cheers. Cheers. Let me refill my cup. Okay. Cheers. I have me a double shot of. Oh, you sipping on my son sipping on tequila. What you do? You uh, chilled it or just ice cube? Ice. He got tequila on ice. So he's sipping on tequila. He said, "I'm doing rum chata and Fireball." <laughs> I'm glad. You know what? Y'all told me y'all want me to start making the drinks on here. I will because I love to try stuff all the time. So I will. Now I made up my little face today. I really love this little nice little beat. It's so natural. Okay, so I really want to start. I should be start. I should be wearing makeup more than I am. But I swear. Makeup just takes so much time for me. Like if I'm planning on going somewhere and doing, oh, we finished the bottle. We finished the bottle. When did we start this bottle? Maybe mean? a couple weeks ago. Yeah, when did I start this bottle? Started? A couple weeks ago. Cause I only drank when, I really only drank when I go live. All right, so both beans are mine, 45%. Okay. Both beans are his. Okay. I just got a habit of stirring my stuff up. All right, y'all, both beans won. I love pinto beans, black beans. It's really like no beans I really don't like. I like lima beans. I like northern beans. I like green beans. Y'all, it's a lot of beans I love. And I remember my mom used to make northern beans and, and cornbread. Ooh, wee. I haven't had that. I got to buy northern beans in a in a can because I don't even know how to make no damn northern beans, but I'm gonna learn how to make them. What's a northern bean? You ain't never had northern beans? I probably had them, but. They're like a the little pale, little pink, look. tan look. It's about this color. Oh, it's like white. Oh, okay. Y'all probably had them. You probably didn't have them. Y'all probably had them. I don't have them probably every day. Cheers, babies. Th cheers, Jet Riders. My love, my supporters, my everything. Cheers. Woo wee. Baby. Mm -hmm. I'm about to be toe up to the flower. Do you understand me? I feel so good because I don't know. I, I end up doing this live early, y'all, because I know where some of y'all is a little later. But let me tell y'all, it's daylight here. Daylight. 
then I'm drinking and, and having a good time. Salute. Salute. Oh, Miss Lissa said, did you get the lashes? I see. Here they are. I got the lashes, baby. I got them on. I didn't put no eyeliner or nothing. Normally, when I put on my lashes, I put an eyeliner over my regular lashes. I just pop these on. And look how they look. How they look. I told y'all one of my supporters sent me lashes. Melissa, I ain't got to lie. <laughs> I ain't got to lie. I don't send myself nothing. I don't act like I, I, don't, I don't act like I got all these anonymous gifts. Anonymous, 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 anonymous. Who sent me this? Who sent me that? I don't do all that. I, I, baby, when they send it to me, I be honest, okay? Because I, 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 I can't fake the funk, okay? I can't, I can't, I can't. Anonymous here, anonymous there. Anonymous, 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 anonymous. <laughs> baby. Thank you, Melissa. Melissa sent me some these lashes. Thank you. <laughs> you look great. Thank you. We love you. I love you guys. I love you guys so much. You don't know how much you guys mean to me. Thank you. Um, it's 9 p.m. here. That's a uh, Francis. That's why I said I had to go on early because I know it'd be late where y'all at. It is. It is going on six o'clock here. So I know you're on the East Coast. Um, you're welcome. Thank you, girl. Thank you. These lashes are so cute. Look at them. I love them. Thank you. Peaceful space. Yes. I'm so glad. You guys, is how I want to spend my Friday. You know, I want to, um, I know y'all in the back, in the past, y'all had, want to do a movie night, okay? We can do a movie night. I got to figure out uh, what movie I'll do. I'll put something maybe on uh, a community post, like... Um, maybe we should do a poll. A poll. Yeah. Maybe I should do a poll on a community post, and I'll let y'all know what Netflix is trending, and y'all vote which one to watch. I don't care about me not getting paid. We can sit and watch the movie, I can be talking while it's playing. We can have a really good time. If you guys want to do that, we can. A movie is normally, what, an hour and a half, two hours long? That's, I, I go live for that, that much time anyway, so I don't care. I just like to hang out with you guys, and I know y'all wanted to do a movie night, so we'll do a movie night. I just got to, I'm going to do it, I have to do it at my computer, so that way I can have Netflix, Netflix playing. I'll be off in a corner somewhere, and I'll be able to, you know, talk, and we... You know, I could pause it. That's right. I could pause it. Give y'all, you know how you people be talking during the movie, baby. That's me. <laughs> I'm like, pause. Did y'all just say what the hell? Just... Man, we should do that. We gonna do that, man. It's gonna be lit, okay? So, I'm gonna, I'll put on a community post. I don't know if I'll do it. I, I don't know if I want to do it this weekend or maybe next weekend, but I'll let y'all know. I'll let y'all know ahead of time. And we can have us some drinks. We chill, watch a movie, give our little, you know, input. I can pause it. Man, that, it'll be lit, okay? I just have to be able, I got to put my account on my computer so that way I can go to Netflix and then we'll watch a movie. Period. Hey, Miss Lisa. I need another drink. Go, oh, my girl! Y'all not finna be having me drinking alone. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. I'm on my second. No, I probably... <laughs> my son's up, this is my last one. I'll probably do one more. <laughs> I love this. Okay. I told you you should have started. Because now the salmon going to be done and you need to warm up this up. Okay, let's let's pause the salmon. Let's just pause the salmon because I want to warm up the beans. It ain't going to take that long to warm up beans, okay? We're going to warm up the beans, the rice, the rice and then I want to cut an avocado because I got avocado. I, I try to pick dishes that don't take long to cook. 
Now, I remember them times when I come over here on Thanksgiving. We be over here for about four, five hours. I've been to cook the whole Thanksgiving meal on live four, five hours. Hey, but we get it done. Well, I don't, I don't, oh, here we go. We get it done. Um, I'm getting another round one of me and Taylor. Okay, the wine. All right, so she the wine. Go get another one. Don't, what she said? Go get another one. Oh, go get another, girl, y'all go get, y'all get another one, okay? I'm washing out this little pot that I made my little oatmeal in. She said one for her and Taylor. Nah. I know somebody probably said, damn, what well, she only got one pot? Why she couldn't just get another? Because I ain't want to. I want to use this pot because I like this pot. You might need a cup because are you going to the corn? Oh, I forgot I got corn. Okay, so this pot hold. Want me to grab one? I need two. Damn. You need two, two more or just one more? I should. I, matter of fact, I should put the corn oh, in one of my microwave container bowls. <laughs> <laughs> I can put, I can put baby everything microwave. I can put one of the container bowls. Container bowls. There we go. Oh God! You make them all kind of work. Look, at that, I got all kind of pots. Don't play with it. Do not play with it. I don't like this pot. I don't like this pot because it got the little, the little Teflon mm -hmm. stuff oh. chip. I, that's because you using metal in this stuff. Yeah, yeah, that's that pot's really messed up. This one ain't done. We keeping this one. I don't like to use it when it's okay. Thank you. That one I really want to. I really want to throw that one away. I really do. Anyway, these pots right here was gifted to me by my little brother. He gave me these for Christmas one year, and I still got them. And <sighs> these pots have not failed me. These ones. These ones. These came from my little brother, but. This, this one got messed up. When it get looking like that, you can't use it. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. And then I got another one. These are my OG pots. These, these old too. I want this. This is what I want. All stainless steel pots. All, that's what I'm about to convert. I'm about to convert all my pots to stainless steel. Like this one. Like this one. How this one is, this is how I want all my pots like this. This, this is what I'm gonna, I'm gonna change to. And yes, I do want that for me. So, I gotta you go. Use the can over? Huh? Go use the can over or the manual? Um, shit, I gotta, get, I gotta bust one of these out. Um, which one you think is easier? The electric one. Oh. oh, these are organic. Oh, bless their heart. I got some organic beans. And then, of course, you know, I just be buying some knockoff stuff. It's cheaper. These was 99 cents a can. But this right here, this came from Costco. Do you know Costco don't sell cans? So you already know I got a damn case. I got a case of this. Case. You know Costco don't sell cans? Now I got to wash off my tops. Yes, I wash. Don't y'all wash off y'all tops? Because y'all know whatever y'all, when y'all open up y'all cans, it's going to fall in your food. Mm-mm. got to wash my top. I got to wash my top. Hey y'all, welcome. <laughs> hey, Lady T. Hey, Lady T. Okay. Just to get on with Dragon. The Hey, Carlotta. Hey, Sonia. The... Go get another one, sis. Okay, I'm stressed, so I need one today. Brothers be giving the best gifts. I know mine's do. And I'm the baby girl. My brother gave me a car before. Mm. Wow, Luan. Mm -hmm. You got a good brother. 
It's hard to have family and siblings to look out for you like that. I remember, now this is the this is the guy out of truth. I can't make this up. My son, he'll he'll tell you. I don't know if he was there. I don't know. But anyways, my <laughs> my <laughs> sister. <laughs> this is for Thanksgiving. I think it was on Thanksgiving Day. My sister had envelopes with money in them for all her siblings. And she was like, if nobody, if they don't show up, they're not getting it. And who's ever here will get it. So it, I think it was on Thanksgiving Day. And baby, I was there because, you know, I'm going to show up. We, we was all partying and having a good time. We, I did not know she was doing this. She came in the house and she said, you know, she was so thankful, thankful and happy. And she just sharing her love to her siblings. Y'all, guess what my sister did? You would not believe this. And it was seven of us, okay? Some people didn't show up. Just Let me just, let me just say that. Some people did not show up. But baby, my sister hand out $500 a piece. $500 a piece. Oh, but I, wait, first of all, she handing out envelopes. I'm opening my envelope. <laughs> <laughs> Who does that? <laughs> Who does that? My sister. <laughs> My sister, baby. That's who does it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Period. She do it big. She do it big, okay? She showed up. That's uh, that's what you call that's those that's my kids' rich auntie. Okay, that that's my kids' rich auntie. That's what they call rich auntie. And if one of my kids called her for something, she looked out. You know, she she's really good. She don't have no children, not because she can't have none. It's because she don't want none. Okay. <laughs> She probably see, seat. she probably see all the shit we went through. She said, fuck that. I don't want no damn baby daddy and be single and fuck that. <laughs> she got nieces and nephews. She got nieces and nephews, period. Ooh. Thank God for electric opener. So this is what I'm saying. When the top falls in, you gotta wash your tops, and I just like to pour a little juice out. Good Friday. Hello, y'all. Hey, Louisa. Um, what we cooking? I'm making salmon bowls. I'm making salmon bowls. Yes, yeah, sometimes they be dusty. <laughs> yeah, you talking about the uh, the guys? Guys do be dusty. He just gave my daughter a truck some. Dang. Luan, your, your brother got some money. Is he single? <laughs> Is he single? Uh, baby, he, if he's single, real kind, nice, know how to treat his woman, very generous, baby, send him my way. Send him my way. <laughs> hey, Melissa. <laughs> do y'all have hoes foods there? Is it a Whole Foods? I know it's a Whole Foods back in Milwaukee. I don't know if it's a Whole Foods. I don't know. I ain't seen Whole Foods so long. Is it Trader Joe's? It's Trader Joe's. It's Trader Joe's. Whole Foods? They do got Whole Foods here. Oh, okay. I ain't been here so long. And they got this other store that's like Whole Foods called Sprouts. Oh, yeah. Plenty Sprouts. I don't know do this shit. The truth be told. Hold on. I'm doing my, using my electric. She said, sorry, he married. I wish I could hook you up. <laughs> oh, he married? Damn. <laughs> that woman is one lucky woman. No, we have to turn it on, so I know you do that. <laughs> Imagine. 
Imagine me <laughs> not telling her. I thought you were doing it. Tell me how to do it. Wait, let me get all the stuff in the pots. Um, hey, uh, oh, that's people talking to each other. Okay. I thought I missed something. Oh, shit. What the hell? I hate when it don't catch on. I open that oven. And then the magnet fell off, didn't it? Yes, it ain't got no magnet. <laughs> and pour a little. I always pour like a little. I don't know. Why do people do that? I just pour like when I see a little trash or something, but I clamp the top. Pinto beans looking good. I hope they taste good. Oh, I hope they taste good. Okay. You did the corn? Yeah. I did all of them. Okay. Let me tell you what you're cooking. I'm making um salmon balls. Salmon balls. So we got salmon, we got brown rice. I like brown rice. She like white rice. So we got jasmine rice, we got pinto beans, we got black beans. What's the black? They call it black beans, right here. Black beans, corn. We got it all. We having a good. I wish I could play music, boy. YouTube is really like funny acting. <sighs> But I guess it's not really being funny acting. It's the artist wants to get paid for the music. I understand. Um, I love both rice, but now I do more brown. Yeah, brown is probably more healthier. Um, but I wanted some jasmine rice. I really like jasmine rice. I don't know why. I just really like it. So let me put this pot, even though I need to throw it in the trash, but I'm just going to put it back on the counter. In the uh, cabinet, I mean, but I don't want to put it back in there wet. Baby, these are some nice cabinets. I ain't messing up my stuff. Uh uh. I am not messing up my stuff. Period. Y'all like jasmine rice? Brown rice is hard to cook. Yes, that's why we got it in the um, we got it like this. So, y'all know before y'all put. Stuff in the, um, before y'all put y'all rice, when y'all making the microwave rice, you're supposed to like separate it. I got this one. I bought a big one. You see, I got a big thing of jasmine. Baby, this could be for, jack for breakfast in the morning. Got to break that rice up before you put it in there. Where's the avocado? Here's the avocado. I gotta pick the one. Let me let me feel which one is the softest. Because these mugs, ooh, this one. These mugs be hard as hell. I got me an avocado. I wanted to dress cute, but I was like, I'm cooking. Let me just put on a black t-shirt and my apron. That's cute. <laughs> because um, I don't want to get messed up. Sometimes cooking to mess you up. on Deborah uh video that we doing some type of organized crime because I know people talking about me I, I I know it what kind of organized crime are we doing <laughs> weird as hell bed spread crew Oh, where I got my apron from? It was sent to me by one of my supporters, Kendra. She made this for me. Queen of the kitchen. It's just thing. Ain't that cute? I was like, man, I got, man, please. I got the best supporters on YouTube. Don't play with it. Okay. 
some people, some, some people ain't found me yet. But when they when they join the part uh the party over here and the family and and uh see how we we do it, they're gonna love it over here, okay? <laughs> I love that apron. Yes, it was sent to me by Kendra. She bought it for me last year, but I'm just now using it. It goes with the aesthetics of the new home. <laughs> it's cute. Thank you. Yep, and then my lashes I got uh, on was sent by one of my supporters, Melissa, or Miss, what's her name? Miss Lisa in here? Miss Lisa. Miss Lissa, Miss Lissa, she sent me these lashes I have on. I did a little makeup today. I think it came out really cute. So on a salmon bowl, do y'all add um, sour cream? Because I bought sour cream. My son said, I don't know if you're supposed to put sour cream on a salmon bowl. I was like, boy, you put whatever you want to put in there. <laughs> Anything you want, okay? You can put anything you want. Yeah, I know I put it on chicken bowls, but I ain't never had it on a salmon bowl. What about if it turn out good? Well, you try. <laughs> do you like sour cream or do you think that will I like sour cream, but you know dairy. That's what I'm saying. Do you think that? I figured that might tear you up. Yeah. Okay. Now, do you like sour cream? And then I don't know how to, I, don't, I need my phone, I need my spoon rest. Hold on, let me grab my spoon rest. Sometimes we use a spoon rest, sometimes we use a plate, sometimes we use a napkin. Damn. And then for that metal one, I can use a regular spoon. I thought organized crime is when you commit a crime. That's what I thought organized crime was. Something like how the mob, the mob was more like an organized crime group. Um, who else could be an organized crime group? Sometimes gangs, gangs could be an organized. Me, myself, I've never been part of any type of Organize crime, organize anything. I'm a senior citizen. I mean, not a senior citizen. I'm a senior. I'm a sick. I'm a U.S. citizen, and I obey by the laws. I don't break no laws. Okay, period. I don't harass. I don't do nothing. Uh, I come on here and talk about my life and my experience and the things that I went through with other people, even if there's if it's a girl or a guy or, a, or whoever I had a, an encounter with, I put my experience on them, on here, what I experienced with them. <clears throat> I talk about my ex, how dog, how they did me wrong, this and that, and I'm going to talk about a friend that I thought was a friend that did me wrong. That is not a fucking crime. Period. Eric said no repo charges over our way. No okay. <laughs> I look at some of y'all videos when y'all be like exposing these weird people, and I be thinking, like, what is the hell be going on with the, in these people's head? Like, I don't I don't understand it. I I, I don't get it. it. It shocks me every time. Grown ass, pathetic ass people. Ain't got no sense in the world. Think they got something, got something on somebody. I got something on somebody too. I got how my address never was put on the internet. Never until I met this one individual. Then all of a sudden, my address was put on the internet. I got proof of that. I screenshot everything, too. What you think this is? I'm not going to let nobody get away with trying to 
sabotage me in any type of way. Any type of way. Because your heart is mean and hateful and dirty and greedy and jealous. My heart is not like that. My heart is not like there's no good going to come to anybody that does anything like that. If you don't if you don't see your 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 uh what you deserve today, baby, you might deserve it. You might get what you deserve next week, next month, next year. Your time is coming. Exposing somebody for who they truly is is not a fucking crime. Exposing the truth is not a crime. Period. This has put on for two minutes. I sit back. I sit back for months and months and months. While somebody talked about me, what well, they thought they was talking about me, they wasn't really talking about me because, baby, they didn't bother me not one bit. When people come back and tell me somebody's talking about me, <clears throat> I mean, I, I just brush that shit off. Like, what? Actually, what did they say? Because that didn't make me mad. <laughs> they make themselves look stupid and jealous and weird. So I'm watching y'all videos and I'm looking at all this chaos and this bull and I'm thinking to myself, okay, people is really, something is really wrong with people. Something is really wrong with people. It's a crime exposing somebody for all the, 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 the things they have done. And the truth be told, if I had done any dirt any wrongdoing, any, made any kind of conflict or enemies on this app, I wouldn't be on here talking about exposing nobody. Because sometimes when you think you're setting a trap, you're setting a trap for yourself. It's in the Bible. Y'all want to get the script? Y'all want to get the script? Y'all know I got a scripture for every damn thing I say. It's in the Bible. You're setting a trap for yourself. So, I mean, setting a trap for others could be setting a trap for yourself. Watch what you do, boo. Watch what you do. Because you ain't no good. You ain't no good. Um, you won't believe the price of the lashes, Justin. I can't send you the link if you want. Keep, keep getting them. Thank you. I thank you, girl. They so cute, and I appreciate you thinking about me, even just thinking about me and sending me these lashes. She says she can send you if you want. Oh, yeah. I just I appreciate you thinking about me, even sending me these lashes. That's what I'm saying. I don't have to sit up here and lie about people sending me stuff and say, anonymous, 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 anonymous. Baby, I got real supporters. I'm not going to spend my money and pretend like people are sending me shit that they're not. Period. People want to sit up there and act like so many people are sending them stuff. It's a part of manipulation. Conning. So people can sit there, oh, well, if they're people send them all that stuff, I might as well send them something too. You go ahead and send them to them. Won't be me. Yeah, I'm gonna do one error. One of these days. What's she saying? What is that? What's she saying? She said I should do a cooking video on my channel. Oh yeah, you like to cook? Cook some of that exotic stuff you be coming up with. <laughs> okay, so what I'm supposed to do right here? Because that we gotta be warm done. it up. That should be me. I just put it on. No. Huh? I just came over here and warmed it up. You didn't see? Oh, you just came over here. Yeah. Eric said, "Did you see my comment about the video you and Tate?" Uh, she. What did she say? I saw. It. You know, you be missing. Oh, she said, why you and Tasty video popped up in my feed at Starbucks? I got the creepiest feeling. <laughs> she said, 
You seen the video? I'm just gonna respond to it. You see how she said, well, I eat more than one sandwich. And I was like, okay. Cause baby, I have points. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I had the points, but okay, if you eat more than one, go ahead. What you want? Let's get you multiple. I got the points, baby, cause I save my stuff. <laughs> I'm a true Starbucks spender. <laughs> Uh, my son, my baby boy, he called me today. He said, hey, Ma, what's your Starbucks? Because um, I want to have a coffee on you. I said, oh, okay, go right ahead. I said, make sure you make it a large and get it however you want to because, baby, this is about to be free. He went up to that counter and said, I'm using my stars. <laughs> uh, he wasn't playing. My baby called me all the time asking for some damn free coffee because he know his mama got it. That's why, period. All right, so we're about to do. I think everything is done. I think it's time to put everything together. That's all warm. Everything's warm. Oh, shit. <laughs> this is she green. Like, how can anybody expose somebody for telling the truth? Be careful. Be, be careful, girl. You're going to set a trap for yourself. It's in the Bible. People do it all the time. My ex did it to me. He set a trap for his damn self. <laughs> but we ain't going to talk about it. <laughs> we ain't going to talk about it. <laughs> Baby, they set traps for their damn self. Okay? I like, a little, I like a little butter in my corn. So, just because I like it buttery. Give me one second, y'all. We're gonna start. Um, we're gonna start making our bowls. I'm gonna show y'all how this be. I hope everything turned out the way I wanted to be. <laughs> I'm buzzed, y'all. I, I said I was gonna have one more drink with y'all, but let me put some on my stomach because I don't want to get sick. Um, yes, he did. Look at how now you're riding well free. Yeah. But first of all, let, let's get it straight. That car I got was a gift, okay? But he tried to take it back. And let me tell y'all some y'all women that find these men that want to buy you things, make sure your name is on there. Because, baby, I made sure my name was on there. When, when we went to that dealership and I said, if my name can't be on this car, I don't want it. I don't want it. And... They said, oh, your name could be on the car. I said, oh, okay. We just want, I just want to make sure. Because my name don't get on this car. I don't give a fuck husband or not. I don't want it. I don't want it. Because they will low down, try to take it from you. If their name is on there, baby, they have all the rights in the world to take it from you. But what saved me is because my name was on it. And it kills me how people will come in my chat they come on my, uh, not my chat, my videos. So I was like, yeah, you, you, uh, that car was in his name. Baby, that car was in my name from the beginning. I made show of it. <laughs> but whatever you say, whatever y'all know more than me, y'all be knowing way more than me. Whatever y'all say. <laughs> because if it wasn't in my name, I wouldn't have the damn car right now. I wouldn't have it. I wouldn't even have it because by law, it would be his car. Think about it. <sighs> okay, so I make, here's your bowl. I'm gonna do my bowl because I, I'm, finna, I'm finna put my rice in here first, but I wanna put a little butter. Ooh, oh, too much rice, shit. <laughs> Hold on, I'm gonna show y'all every step of the way. Hold on, here's my rice. See, I just want to put a little um, butter in it. Good thinking, Justin. <laughs> Baby, I'm smart. Okay, I I didn't. I wasn't just born yesterday. Okay. When you get married and everything, and you got to make sure everything is the way it should be. I never knew somebody would cross me. I didn't think anything of it, but. 
I see now, you gotta prepare. You have to prepare. And when I meet the next gentleman in my life, I'm gonna still be prepared. I'm really gonna be on alert now because look what just happened to me. I'm gonna be on high alert. Some people say, oh, just then you keep talking about your husband, you still want him. No, I'm talking about my husband because, and if it, it don't even gotta be my husband, it could be any ex in my life. I talked about all their asses, okay? Stop acting like it's just one person I talk about. I talked about all their asses, all of them. If they was any good, I'd still be with them. Obviously, something happened, we're not together, okay? But some left on a good note, some left on a bad note, period. I learned something from each and every last one of their ass, okay? I'm gonna show, share my experience with women from everybody, not no one particular person. This is my experience and what I went through and I have a white right to share that. All right, y'all, let me get my little, my little, <laughs> what you call these? Little sides? Toppings, really. Toppings? Okay. Hold on, y'all. Oh, this is the teriyaki sauce we got. Y'all, anything Kinder's is amazing. Y'all, we got so many Kinder sauces. The sauces, the seasoning, everything. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Over oh, porn, I didn't even know. <laughs> Damn, you buzz? You buzz! <laughs> hey, my little bitch. Okay, so so far it's looking like this. I got my corn, I got my pencil peas, I got my black eyed, uh, black, why I keep on saying black eyed peas? I got that, now I'm gonna add my salmon. Mine, yeah. Oh, I was gonna say, oh, okay. That's fine, I did mine, yeah, show them brown, brown rice. rice. He got brown rice. Don't forget the avocado. Oh yeah, you cut it? Yeah, it's right there. I was gonna chop me up the onion, but I ain't feel like doing all that. So I add the little salmon bites on there. Let me put my little Kinder sauce. This is the teriyaki sauce. And it looks like this. And now I'm gonna add my avocado. Oh, and I'm gonna add a little bit of sour cream. Look, that's my avocado. I just smashed it on there, baby. Period. <laughs> that looks good. I'll tell y'all how good it is. Hold on. Hey, Michelle. Well, let's just say y'all both buzzed. <laughs> no, she way more buzzed than me. I'm only buzzed. Y'all, I had, you know I'm buzzed because I had two drinks on the empty stomach. Don't play with it. Pretty as a woman, you need your own account. Car, home, apartment. You know what? My next, I'm gonna make sure my next man, that's why he gotta be rich. He's gonna, I'm gonna make sure he set me up pretty. Set me up nice. Where if anything happens, uh, I'm I'm straight. Okay. I'm gonna make sure the next one set me up right. That's why I don't I can't deal with nobody that. Okay, let's try a little sour cream. They really can't do nothing for me. <laughs> all right, y'all. Here comes the taste test. Let's see. Do you mix it all up? How you doing? Do yours? Yeah, I mix it up. Honey. You gonna mix it like stir it all up? Mm -hmm. Do we stir it all up, guys? Okay, let's stir it all up. Ooh. Oh, this is... Hold on, I gotta cut up my avocado. I be feeling guilty. I can't share this with some other people. Like my son and my daughter. <laughs> I be feeling guilty they not here trying this with us. Oh, well, I feel guilty plenty of days, okay? This ain't the first time. All right, let's try it. Period! <laughs> oh my God, this is amazing.
The sour cream really don't make a, I mean, hot sauce. That's what I mean. Because I'm a hot sauce girl. Hold on, y'all. Let me grab my hot sauce. Y'all, I love hot sauce, okay? Don't judge me. Let's just put on half of the bowl. Mix it up. Let's see. Taste it, taste it, taste it, taste it. I need your opinion. Missy Missa, you should have put an egg in it. Mmm. An egg would have been busting. Let me see what my son thinks. Hold on. Let me get a cup of my box so I'm about to make another drink. And the salmon is good mm -hmm. to perfection, ain't it? Mm -hmm. Cook perfect. Good thing you started off low. Mm -hmm. Salmon don't take that long, everybody. God is good. Thank you, Lord, for this food. I'm sorry. I, I ain't even pray. Lord, thank you for the food that we are eating. Amen. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, one more bite. Mm. I can't make this stuff up. Time for another drink. <laughs> y'all, I'm getting ready to go on a trip, y'all. And I'm going on a trip. And I know my, I don't even know. I hope and pray we don't be drinking all day and night. <laughs> but I know we're going to be doing some drinking. Okay? I know we're going to be doing some drinking. But I hope it's more, more towards the evening. Because we gotta uh, during the daytime we're gonna be doing a lot of sightseeing. Let me um, make a drink. It's good, ain't it? I'm really impressed. <laughs> I've been seeing people making salmon bites, and I was like, I gotta do that. I gotta do that. I gotta do that. I did that. Hold on, y'all. Look like I ain't even finished my first drink. I'm trying to make a second one. Hold on, let me drink some of them. Let me see what y'all talking about. I love how you enjoying the food. Hey, Kendra! Look, Kendra! Look! <laughs> <laughs> Look, I finally wore it. Thank you. Hey, Bernard, welcome. I use the same kind of hot sauce. Yes, and then this is the um, teriyaki sauce. You could just put the teriyaki sauce, but I'm a hot sauce girl. What's the hot sauce? Hey, Bernard, pretty brown Virgo, Kendra. What hey, Louisa you? spoke to everybody, huh? What hot sauce are you? Frank's. Oh. Frank's is the best, baby. Mm -hmm. This is what I grew up off of. My grandma used to keep up. Uh, Mm. But my mama had Frank's. That's how I know about his Frank's. He's talking about his other grandma. I like Frank's. Yeah. That's what I say. A lot of people like Louisiana. I, I wasn't like a Louisiana hot sauce girl. More like pepper. Like pepper mm. sauce. Way more kind any. And hotter. Mm hmm. Way more spicier. Hey, Renelle, welcome. 
I'm still on my first drink. La what? Well, listen, I ain't gonna tell nobody how to drink they drink. Uh-uh. Cause I don't want nobody. Now, the only person, now I'm gonna be honest, because y'all know I tell the truth. The only person that pesterized me and pushed me to drink is my youngest son. I don't know what the hell he does that to everybody. He's like everybody be lit. Mm-hmm. Bless his heart. But he does that to everybody. He be like, come on, mama, your baby's dead. Drink it, drink it, drink, drink, drink. I'm like, damn. <laughs> Warning, don't drink with him. <laughs> y'all, if we ever, because my, um, my boy said, if I meet up with y'all, if I meet up with y'all and we doing some type of meetup, vacation type things, they said they coming, okay? Mm -hmm. So... My boys, that would be uh, the youngest one. Don't get it twisted. He gonna be the hype man. He gonna be like, oh, oh, Carlotta, I know you not, <laughs> Louisa, uh, Miss Gloria, like he that type of person. Oh, I know you not, baby. Oh, you, you ready for a second? That's the child. That's how he is. You can't get mad at him though. You got uh, bless his heart. That's how he is. Okay, <laughs> Mama, I know you, Mama. You ready for another? I know you ready. I know you ready, <laughs> boy. And like an idiot, I be just like, okay, yeah, okay. Girl, my baby is the, woo, I thought I was the life of the party. He's the life of the party. He's going to hype you up, okay? So I hope, if we do a cruise, he will come. Hella Cray won't come because he said he cannot get in the middle of the water. But if we do, <laughs> but if we do a meet up and a vacation somewhere where we meeting up at, then... Of course, my boys want to be there. I was crazy. I just posted a video today about her cruise. Mm -hmm. I said, you never catch me on a cruise. Mm. Let me show you the video. A cruise is really not that bad. I was scared my first time on a cruise. I think, I, I think I'll think i be okay for the second time. Look at this cruise, how, how the waves got to move. Ain't no way in the world. Oh my God, I would be scared. Ain't no way. Wait, let me see if I can show them that. Look how this look how this ship was moving. Yeah, I'm on the land only. Look, 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 look how this Ooh, look how it's about to Oh my god. Uh-uh. Mm -hmm. So my first time was on the cruise was when um at the time he was somebody I was dating. He took me on the cruise and dude, I was so nervous being on the cruise. This is my first time ever on the cruise, but again, you know, I'm down for anything because you know. I'm just living life. So, anyways, I go on a cruise. <laughs> so, I'm really excited about being on a cruise. I've never been on a cruise. I want to be on a cruise during the day. I mean, I want to explore the ship during the day at night. I'm going to just tell y'all about my little cruise excursion. Wait, hold on. Let me give one more little bite. And then I got to put my little bowl up. Hold on. This food is good. Normally, I don't eat this much. <laughs> you know it's good if I eat this much. Mm, 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 mm. I gotta get one more bite. I gotta If you drink, you guys, make sure you drink the water, too. Make sure you drink your water. Because every time I'm drinking, if I'm at a bar, at a club, I'm getting water and a drink. That was a blind one. Okay, so, Fenty, just in case y'all want to know. 
Anywho, so let me talk about my first time on the cruise. So he he was like, you ever been on a cruise? And I said, no, I've never been on a cruise. He said, I want to take you on a cruise. And I said, okay. I was a little nervous because I was one of those people that I'll never go on a cruise because I don't know how to swim. So I goes on this cruise, right? So I'm excited. I'm on this boat. And baby, when you get on that boat, the boat is bigger than life. First of all, you're, you're walking up to this big, and you're like, damn, this thing is huge. But when you go on the boat, you're like, wow, it's, it's, it's huge. You got the spa, you got shopping, you got uh, bingo, you got comedy, you got a club, you got a dinner. It is so many things on a boat to do. And then on top of that, it's a bar on every damn corner Every damn you go, every way, halfway you walk, so it's a bar. You walk, it's a bar. It's a bar every damn where you go, okay? You can't help it but drink, <laughs> okay? Hey, welcome. Justin, you're brave. I'm terrified large bodies of water. Baby, this is my first time. I didn't know what to expect, mm -hmm. but I didn't want to, um, you know how they say when, um, how do you say it? When an opportunity comes, you don't want to miss that opportunity. So I felt like this was the, my opportunity to experience something I never experienced, even though I always was scared. Hell, I was scared to fly, but I flew. So sometimes you're going to do things, even though it seems scary, you still want to try it. Baby, that's me. I I went on a helicopter. I knew I was scared of a helicopter. I went on a helicopter. I never went on either. See, you, you keep on knocking stuff. So anyways, honey, let's, let's, let's continue. I goes on this trip, okay? So we on it, we on it, everywhere's a bar. You go by the swimming pool, you on the high deck, you on the low deck, you on the middle deck, you on the edge, everywhere's a goddamn bar, okay? So he, by his experience, he already knew that we had to purchase a drinking pass. Now, a drinking pass, let me tell y'all, The drinking pass is paid for in advance, right? You pay for this in advance. And the drinking pass allows you 15 drinks per day. Remember that. 15 per day. <laughs> but I, I I know damn well I can't make 15. I, I be, look, I'm, a, I'm, I'm about to make my third drink. I'm still on my second drink, okay? 15 a day. 15 a day. So that means you, you wake up in the morning, you can have mimosas. By the afternoon, you can have another cocktail. In the evening time, you can have some more drinks, right? And then the cruise turn. <laughs> That's great. It's called Facing Your Fears, right? I've been watching videos with cruise ships have sink. I'm scared. Yes, that's scary. Everything is scary, y'all. Okay? I think every day we live life on the edge. Hell, we driving down the street, we live life on the edge. We don't know what's going to happen, right? So I'm on this cruise ship. Uh, my first night, I want to experience everything. So at nighttime, I said, hey, can we walk on the top? I want to see, you know, how it looks at night. Baby, being in the middle of the ocean is pitch dark. Pitch dark. You, there's no sign of land. You don't see no lights nowhere. The only light you see is from the moon. And when the moon hits down on that water, I ain't gonna lie, it is beautiful. It is beautiful. But baby, it is scary. Pitch black. You only, all you see is darkness all around you. Okay, and you can go out there on the on the on the ship whenever you want to. You can be out there middle of the night if you want to. It's it's not closed off to nobody. Okay, it's black the ocean. Yes, that moon hitting that water is beautiful. And um, I've me and my kids we we've been to the ocean in California. They were they've seen the moon hit the water at night. It is beautiful. Okay. So just imagine being in the middle of nowhere all around you in the moon. Like, you're like, wow, this is crazy. 
Okay, the ship is rocking. It's doing its thing. The ship is not no smooth sailing. The whole damn time, the ship is rocking. Okay. So, anyways, I'm, I'm in the I'm at nighttime. The, I don't know why I woke up. Probably because some noise woke me up. <laughs> so, anyways, I looked out the window just to see what it looks like. Baby, it looked like water was splashing on the window. So I got so paranoid, I thought we were sinking. I said, ah, wake up, wake up, we're sinking! Oh, he said, whoa, 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 well, hold on. I said, we're sinking. The water's hitting the window. We're sinking. He's like, hold on, hold on. He said, if we were sinking, we would hear all kind of alarms. People be running. Calm down. We're not. I said, but come on, look, look out the way. He said, yeah, it just looks like that. We're not. Baby, I was tetrified. <laughs> uh, I feel sorry for his ass. I was, ooh, I was going, ooh, I was going crazy, okay? So, um, I think it was, I was on there for like a couple of days. So, anyways, the next day or whatever, we, we out on top. They got a, 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 a swimming pool. Everybody's partying. They're playing all the, it's partying. You know, everybody's playing. And we dancing, partying, drinking. Because you get 15 drinks a day. Remember I meant to tell you about the 15 drinks a day? So I never hit my 15. So he was like, hey, we paying for 15 drinks a day, right? Uh, just go ahead with, your, with yours. Just get tequila so we can hit the 15. I said, okay. <laughs> so we was taking these shots of tequila on his request because, baby, I don't drink that. So <laughs> we taking these shots of tequila off my pass because we paid for it. And we're putting it, you know, it's a little safe in the room. We're putting the drinks in the safe. <laughs> so that, because they come in your room every day. They come in your room every day to clean. You can't say not clean, Okay. So they come to your room every day, but we know if we put these drinks in the in the safe, nobody gonna mess with them. So I'm putting the drinks in the safe. We piling up. We had like a little pile of, of drinks in there. We 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 stockpiling. <laughs> okay, okay, make this shit up. Okay, so we stockpiling. And then uh, because remember, I can't hit my 15. I, the best I probably did was like seven eight. Because I can't hit 15. I don't, I don't, I don't really get down like that. So, anyways, um, every day you come in your room. Okay, you come in your room, you got an itinerary, what's going on, and you have a towel that's made of a pet. It would it could be a bunny one day, it could be a swan the next. I'm like, this was really nice. And every time the person that was working our room, they'll greet you. Hello, Mr. and Mrs. You know, like that. It was really impressive. Like they never skipped the beat. Hello, Miss Ray, how was your day? Oh, how you guys doing it? And he, that person was always in your corridor to meet you, right? <laughs> My auntie won 50,000. Oh, we went to the, um, we won. He won, bingo. I think it was like $500, but this is what happens. When you win, they don't really give you the cash. They subtract anything you use. So we went to the spa. Uh -huh. So instead of him paying like the spa out his money, they subtracted yeah. from the money he won. Mm. That was cool though. Cool. Yeah. So we went to the spa. We went to boutiques. We went to um, casino. We went to a comedy show one night. We went to the comedy show two nights. We went to a club one night. I was in there partying. We had so much fun. At least I had fun. I don't know about him. Yeah, 50000 though, they got to give you 50000 They got to give you that because you ain't going to spend no damn 50000 They got to cash. They, I need a check, baby, right now. So, anyway, people were drunk as a skunk. People were, like, they was all dazed like this. It's like, I hit my 15 limit. You know, people, people, I hit my 15 limit. I was like, I wish I could help you. If you wanted another drink, I wish I could help them, but we were stockpiling, right? <laughs> so anyways, my drinks, my drinks were stockpiling. He was hitting his. So anyways, while one day I opened up a safe, I said, the drinks is gone. He said, he said, oh, I, I drunk them. <laughs> <laughs> I think what it was, he was drinking them 
as we was putting them in. I just wasn't noticing it. You know, I think it was drinking. We put, we put the damn thing. I thought the, the damn people that cleaned the room took the damn drinks. I was like, the drinks is gone. He said, oh, I drunk them. I said, what? The fuck you eating? <laughs> I couldn't believe it. I'm like, what the hell? Man, I ain't gonna lie. I had fun. That's one of the most fun vacations I had. I ain't gonna lie. Now, you know, another fun vacation I had when we went to Sacramento, I vlogged that. I vlogged the cruise. I vlogged the Sacramento. Yeah, please like the live, y'all. Uh, I, I vlogged the Sacramento trip. The Sacramento trip was fun, but baby, oh, I... Yeah, that's when I was went on the little train, the little trolley. Yeah. And then I was complaining. I was like, yeah, I got to, um, y'all, I'm walking up this hill. I'm vlogging. The hill, I can't do it. He was like, take off the damn mask. Even people was leaving vlog. Like, just think you should have took off the mask. But hell, it was corona. <laughs> I don't know where the hell the, control, the corona's at. And you in California, that shit is deep. Okay? I did not want to be walking up the sidewalk. And that, you could. Man, walking up them sidewalks is no joke. It's like climbing a hill. I was to the point, I was like, listen here. We need to call a damn Uber, and we need to call an Uber now. I'm not doing this shit. <laughs> this, that, that's how it was. It was just that bad. <laughs> Man, I vlogged it. it was, I don't even know if it's still on here because a lot of videos I did private with him. That one might be still on here. I don't know. The cruise, I'm sure, is still on here because I was kind of priving it backwards. But you yeah. You got uh, Icon of the Sea ship, the biggest cruise ship. What happened? Have you seen the biggest cruise ship? I've been watching videos about that. It's like 20 floors, like 20, 20 decks, and it's longer than the. Uh, I would be scared. It's longer than the Eiffel Tower. It's real big. I, I would Ooh. be scared to go on that cruise. Ooh. I went to the. um, Car what, Which one I went to? Caribbean? Caribbean, what's it called? Caribbean, I think that's what it was. Mm -hmm. They got the Caribbean, they got the princess. We're going for like the Bahamas. Yeah, we went down to Mexico, the oh, Baja. Mexico. Yeah. yeah. We went to the down there to the Maha. We got off the ship. Went to Mexico. Man, we got off the ship, had some drinks, did a little little shopping, little stuff, man. We came back, man. We came back because you gotta you you only can have like six hours, six or eight hours that you could be off the ship. And explore. Sometimes they'll, depending on your cruise, they'll be, they'll be uh, pulled over for a whole day, and you basically got that whole day and the next morning before they take off. It depends. On you. And then you know they got the Alaska cruise too, where you go all the way up to Alaska and come. Man, I wasn't gonna do that either. Cause what about if you hit an iceberg, just like the Titanic? The Titanic hit an iceberg. That's one of the reasons. I Girl, I remember that vlog. So, yeah, you been around since that vlog? Girl, she's an OG, okay? <laughs> like airplane bathrooms are small. Yes, the airplane bathroom, you only can go like this. You you, you can't really do nothing. I mean, but go I mean, in there turning I mean, around. Like this. You be what? I mean, like this in the airplane. <laughs> and then, you know, women, they don't, they, can't, they don't sit on the seat. So you gotta pull your little pants down, squat, and you holding on to the door, make uh, my damn head bumping the damn door. I I can really hold my head on the door and keep me from tipping over. Like it's crazy. <laughs> oh. Hey, but that that airport, that airplane got the best little hand soap in that bathroom. That hand soap smell good. Where did that? What kind of hand soap is that? That hand soap smell good. <laughs> Yeah, I'm good with the iceberg. I was scared to go on my cruise because thinking about the Titanic, but I still went. Did you have a good time, Melissa? I know you had a good time because I had a good time on my cruise. I really had a good time. And I don't hit a turbulent, your pee, pot, or poop going everywhere. Ooh, I ain't never experienced that one. <laughs> but I did have to use the bathroom one time because they was like, um, hey guys, we're about to head some turbulence, fasten up your seatbelt. And I was like, man, let me get ready to use the, I had to use the bathroom so bad. I was like, let me go run to the bathroom before this turbulence hit. And it was shaking really bad when I was in there. I was scared. I was like, please don't let it drop and my head hit the ceiling. 
Mm, mm, mm. I was really nervous. How long we been on this live? Oh, okay. Not bad. Um, that was four years ago. Yes, I did. I went to the Bahamas. Hey, little mommy, welcome. Yeah, we just talking about trips. I cooked. I'm done cooking. I'm about to have another little quick little drink real quick. Let me make a little quick drink with y'all. I'm not gonna, I'm not even gonna do a whole full one. This cake's pretty good. It is. I, maybe I should try it too. What dessert? Y'all, we picked up this for dessert. I like how you grab it and cut and eat. <laughs> y'all remember? Uh-oh. Y'all remember the uh seven up cakes? We grabbed the seven up cake. <laughs> I want to go to Jamaica. I want to go to Bahamas. For my number one vacation place I want to go to, you already know. Who? Who? Tokyo. How? How is you going to go to Tokyo if you, you don't want to fly that far? I'm just having to do it. You got to get your passport. Yeah. You going to do it? Yeah. Okay, I'm just going to do half. You going to go? Yeah. Dude, you the one. You would be way more scared than me. What you talking about? <laughs> You're way more scared than I am. Sure. But we have fun, don't we? We flying, don't we? Mm -hmm. we be lit. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, yeah, we be lit. Girl, I be on the fly. I'm like, uh, you want a drink? Let's get a drink. Let's get a shot. Let's get it. But man, before my kids was little, when I couldn't drink with them, they was minors. My first time, um, he had flew to Pennsylvania with his dad. That was his first time flying. But then I had did a trip where I flew uh, my kids to Vegas because at the time my oldest son was living in Vegas. So the two youngest ones, Marisha and Mac, they never flew before. And of course he flew before. So we had went to um, um, Vegas. And so him and um, Marisha sat together and me and Mac sat together. And I was like, okay, I was telling him, I said, you want to watch a movie? Me and you finna watch a movie. They did watch. I said, no, whoever watch, whoever sit with me get to watch a movie. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't watch a movie, y'all. <laughs> huh? I had a yeah. No, I think it was free. I think nobody y'all didn't have headphones oh, or something. Okay. Or maybe at the time, I don't know if I did have to pay for it. That was a long time ago. I'm thinking maybe I did have to pay for it. Me and him, I just, I don't even know how it went. Damn. Wow, cheap. <laughs> so me and my baby girl, because that was my baby. He had, my baby had to sit by me because he was the baby. And then them two sat, each, sat uh, next to each other because they was, the, you know, they both are middle kids. So they sat next to me, but they was right next to me. They was right next to me, right across the aisle. That's all. Like, I can just... I just, all I had to do was like, what, y'all okay? Y'all need, yeah, that's how I was. Like, I'm not finna sit far from my kids. Yeah, so anyways, we went to Vegas. We had a really good time. That was, that wasn't my first time in Vegas, but that was their first time in Vegas. And we had to visit my oldest son. Yeah, but ever since then, we've been to Vegas numerous times. So, Vegas is a cool trip, but it's not something that would be on my list to do. Because I've been there so many times already. I'm just not Vegas crazy. I'd rather just go do other things, you know? Yeah, I went a couple of years ago. I belong. Oh, yeah, that's right. You went by yourself. Mm -hmm. uh, well, you went with some friends. Um, then uh, Mac. Oh, yeah. And Naya had went together. That was like last time, I think, went together. Well, last I think, time you been there. And the last time I was there. Oh, uh, was when we all went. When we all went, yeah. yeah, that was the last mm -hmm. time I went, and that was four, almost four years ago. Mm -hmm. Wow! Mm -hmm. It's time for a Vegas trip. It's time for a Vegas trip. <laughs> you ain't never lied. It's time for a Vegas trip. Y'all ready? Y'all ready? Y'all ready? Pack up y'all suitcase and go to Vegas. Let me know. It's time for a Vegas trip. Y'all ready? Let's go. But Vegas, I don't have to fly to Vegas, y'all. I can drive to Vegas. It's literally four hours away. Hmm. 
Um, let's go. Let's get our passport by the end of the month. Hella crazy. Oh, Lawan, you better get your passport if you want to take a trip. If we doing Jamaica, Bahamas, but I don't know. I thought our first like group trip would be here in the states. Don't y'all think that would be more suitable to do here in the states? And then mm -hmm. if we're having a good time, then do a next trip somewhere else. I think a group trip would be nice here in the states. We can go somewhere like Vegas. Maybe be somewhere like Puerto Rico. I'm part of the state. That's nice. I've never been to Puerto Rico. We also can do a Mexico trip. I've been to Tan Tan Cancun. I was about to say Cancun. <laughs> I've been to Cancun. We could do Turks and Caicos. We can do Tulum, uh, Puerto Vallarta. <laughs> Somebody gonna have to drug me because I. <laughs> you take a Benadryl. Did you know that? That's what I take. Every time I get ready to get on the plane, I take a damn Benadryl. <laughs> I take a shot. Oh, he said, I take a Benadryl, shot baby. Take the capsule, cap, capsule, and baby, give it thirty minutes before you get on there. When you get on there, you be you be so drowsy and sleepy, you ain't gonna be thinking about it. Mm -hmm. Two, three shots. Be but if you sit next to me, warning. <laughs> mm. Don't sit next to her. If anybody sit next to me, this is a warning. Mm -hmm. Which y'all probably won't be sitting next to me because I'll probably be getting a tick with somebody else. <laughs> but if you would sit next to me, I would be grabbing you every few minutes. Okay? Every few seconds. <laughs> Man, she's scared. Everybody, what was that? Every, what was that? <laughs> <laughs> he always, oh my God. <laughs> Oh, yeah. he, he looking at me like I'm crazy. I'm like, boy, you all don't look at me like that. You already know what time it is. You know damn well I'm scared of this shit. <laughs> he got to look at me, turn on my nose like what it is because I make low key, I be making him nervous. <laughs> she make everybody on the plane nervous. Hmm? Scary. I'm not going where that girl was. Oh, that I know that was sad about the girl, her friends. Mm. I wouldn't even stay at that resort or whatever that was, Airbnb. I wouldn't even stay there. Mm -mm. We would never go nowhere like that, okay? I remember when you camped out of your car just then. It was scary. Mm -hmm. I'm scared. You know, I'm scared of dark. Hell, I'm scared of dark in my own damn house. I'm definitely gonna be scared and dark in the car. I have no protection. <laughs> I have no protection. The only way you can get away, you got to hurry up and jump in the front seat and go. It's a shame to say last time a travel went to Virginia Beach and stayed in a big Airbnb with a woman's retreat. It was nice. Oh, that was nice, Luan. That's what we need to have, like a little woman's retreat. But um, I don't know. But if you guys want to do it, like, I, I don't know. I think more about it. But if y'all want to do a trip where y'all want to come to Arizona and y'all never been to Arizona, then maybe I can set up something. We get an Airbnb. Or if y'all want to do a trip, we go to um, Vegas. And then we can all kind of like get our own room. And then we just have, we just know to meet each other down by the lobby at a certain time. We go hang out on the strip. We know we'll meet up with a certain time for dinner. You know, I think that would be nice too. Y'all let me know. This could become like a little thing, a little thing that we do probably every year. If it turned out right. If it don't turn out right, then I would be like, hell no. Nah. <laughs> I've been to Vegas before, yes, years ago. Yeah, it's been almost four years since I've been. I would love to go to Vegas. I really like these lashes. They're not too dramatic, just really right. right. They're not really like long, they're really nice. These are some really nice lashes. I think that would be nice. You would go with Michelle. But Michelle, you would do a trip. I know Michelle would do a trip. Michelle, Luan, Eris B, who? Carlotta. Carlotta. 
Uh, who else? Yes, I'm down for that. Okay, pretty brown thing. I said pretty dial thing, but you know what I'm saying. <laughs> um, yes, before it get hot. <laughs> I love mommy. Girl, if it be hot and we go, we just got to wear like summer stuff. Really like tank top shorts. Yeah, we could put on shorts, tank tops. We definitely got to, if we go to Vegas, we definitely have, have to have good shoes. We don't have to go in the summertime. We could plan something more towards the fall and the winter of this year, and it'd be even beautiful. And then we'll one night we'll go to dinner, dress up, make a, you know, make a nice little dinner where we all dress up and look cute and fancy. And then every day we go out and strip, hang out, do some shopping, just do like little like tourist type stuff. Maybe we could rent one year. Uh, one time when I went to Vegas with uh, CJ and them, we had rent uh, the little scooters. Maybe we could rent scooters and ride around. Just doing some fun. So we don't really have to go in the summertime because I know it is the the heat is very torturous here in in Arizona. I wouldn't even want to do that to anybody that's coming. I would pick the perfect time. For us to go where it's kind of cooler and we can enjoy ourselves, okay? More towards the fall, beginning of the winter. I think it would be a perfect time. Like November, I think. That would be good too because a lot of people might be in cold places so they get to go somewhere warm. Exactly. Maybe less traffic there. Um, I can see if I talk to the hotel, if we plan a trip. But hey, if I got a group of people... And let's say I rent 10 rooms. Can you give it to us at a discounted price? You know, I'll talk to see. If not, I'll probably get with a travel agent. Agent. So. Yes, because the sun. Yes, because I know how it is here. And Vegas and, and Arizona is the same. Where whatever happens in Vegas, we're basically happening here. The, the heat. And also, um, it's a part of California mm -hmm. Is the same way, like the Palm Spring. Palm Spring is the, is the desert, <clears throat> even though it's in California. Palm Springs area is the desert. Over here by Coachella. That's yeah, that's Coachella, Palm Spring, um, all that right there is hot, and then Arizona, and then Nevada, the lower Nevada, which is Vegas and stuff. Yes, and so I remember those vlogs, a trip with CJ. Y'all have, man, we had so much fun. Tell you been around pretty long time, a long time too with CJ. Girl, CJ don't mess with me no more. He got all big and bougie, baby. He don't know me. Okay. He don't know us. He got, he hit, he hit that 800K and he got all that jewelry and, and design and stuff, baby. I've been doing that before him. But baby, he don't know me. <clears throat> Okay, anyway. <clears throat> I was doing that before him. <laughs> he get a little money, boy. You so Money change you. That let me know right then and there, money will change you. Because, baby, you all big headed. And I, you know, I, I, got the, I got the design of stuff to hang around you. I ain't no poor little girl and mooching off nobody. If I want to come down and hang out with you, I got my own damn money. I ain't got to, I don't ask nobody for nothing. I didn't, the Vegas trip wasn't sponsored by him. Vegas trip was sponsored by me, period. So I don't know what the, the funny acting come in at. I don't, I don't understand it. Baby, he get, he got a little money boy. I mean, he already was having some little money, but now he got more money. You know what I'm saying? It changed him. And I was like, God, please don't let me be like that. Do not humble, keep me humble keep me good and I'm glad I experienced having things when I I wasn't even rich because that just let me know when I be, when I become the millionaire that I'm about to be I already told you I manifest a millionaire when I become a millionaire baby I know how I'm gonna be the same old person because I've been the same old person ever since by having having red bottom shoes and and Louis Vuitton shoes and it never changed me I still got that shit it never changed me. But him, it changed. He, he wasn't wearing none of that. 
wasn't wearing none of that when we met him. He was in Jordans. Always popped a new pair of J's before it came out. That's the type of dude he was. I, when I came to Vegas, baby, I had a pair of red bottom heels on. Going out to the club with them. That's what I'm saying. I'm, I'm not new to this. I'm, I'm true to this. That's why God, please keep me humble because I know I'm about to be a millionaire because huh, you said ask, I shall receive, baby, I'm asking. Okay. I know it's coming. And uh, manifest. Believe in your heart and it shall, it's going to come to pass. Okay? Believe as if you already have it. The Bible already teaches you manifestation. A lot of people tell me, oh, I never knew manifestation. I never heard of it. Well, the Bible already was teaching us that. Okay? Manifest. Act as if it's already done and it's done. Believe it in your heart. Okay? I want my sons to get Grand, see the Grand Canyon. Okay. Grand Canyon. Um, I would never see the Grand Canyon. <laughs> Y'all have fun with that one. <laughs> so after hearing like the the experience like Mary had did, Mary said she had went to the Grand Canyon. Mm -hmm. and she's been there a couple times. But she said it was scary. Scary, yeah. She said it was scary. Mm -hmm. And when she said it was scary and the drive up there is scary and everything is scary, I'm going to leave that alone. Because <laughs> if you telling me it's scary... Why would I want to put myself in fear? Why Why would I want that kind of trip? But there's so many people that go there. Did y'all know it? Happened. Did y'all know at the Grand Canyon they got a, a thing that you could pay for that you could step out on and it's a it's a glass yeah. floor. Mm -hmm. Would y'all step out on a glass floor so you could see down into the Grand? I wish I would. <laughs> I, I I wish I would pay for that. Do y'all y'all want me to make that trip? I will make that trip if y'all want me to. You should go there. See if you I should go. And this is what I do. I have my camera. <laughs> I have my camera on the thing. <laughs> Let me see. <laughs> I have my camera. I said, do y'all see it? <laughs> y'all see it? That's how, that's how I'm in. Hold up. I see it when I, I see it when I edit. Y'all see it down there? Okay. That's that. Y'all want me to do that? Cause that's baby. That's what I'm gonna do. Okay, I ain't playing with nothing glass. I ain't playing with nothing glass. I remember that time that Diera, Diera and Ken went on the trip. And she was scared because she's like, I oh, choose down at the bottom holding on. Girl. Forget holding on. What the hell made you go out there? Yeah, yeah. Did you know they they did they, they did on that, that thing where they was they had strap jackets and they had to lean forward with their hand and you lean on the edge with your baby. It's some stuff like that, baby. I would never. Do you wow. understand that? Never. Never. I've been playing with your life like that. <laughs> I don't give a I don't care about no edge. I can look out the window. I don't care about no edge. I can see that. I can see you. I, I, I can see. I see it. Do not. Do not. Do. Do not. The video is enough for me. Yes, I'm not doing it. Mm -mm. <laughs> Forget that. Uh uh. Uh uh. Never in a million year years. Uh uh. Mm. It's stuff in Chicago like that. Mm. The only thing I want to do, and I do want to do this. I want to do dinner in the sky. Mm -hmm. I do want to have the dinner where they take you up. I don't have. I don't know how far they take you up. I can't even do that. I am. You I want to do the building that go up. No, the little platform that goes yeah, up and have the person. Building. No, it's the edge. You know, you lean over, you can see outside. Out. You ain't never seen that the dinner thing in the sky. Oh yeah, you true. Go Google it. Look it up. You true. I don't know if they, I don't know what they had here, but I think. 
Let's see what they had at dinner. Dinner um, in the sky or on the platform. Dubai? Dubai? Oh, I'll, never. You will not do that. That's <laughs> it. So I showed it. Yes, I will. Yes, I will do that. I, w I was, I was, I will sit forward, eat my food, anything. Don't move, don't touch me. <laughs> I'll be eating like, <laughs> that's how I be. I'll be looking over. <laughs> I know, I want to do that. Let me see. <laughs> ain't no way in the world. You'll do that? No. You ain't doing that. <laughs> <laughs> I want to though. Would y'all do that? Who y'all gonna do that to, with me in Vegas? If y'all go to Vegas, would y'all do that with me? You ever seen that uh, <laughs> the little ride in Vegas that's hanging off the building and it kind of like teeter top like this? It like go up. I went up there. You ain't going on that. No. Okay. You ain't going on that building? Yeah. Okay. It's called the the uh, the sky the skyscraper the building. When you go up there, it's like a restaurant, dining, but it's also where you can go off to get on those rides. Mm -hmm. So I'm up there and I'm looking, I vlogged it. I looked at the people getting, I said, ain't no goddamn way. I'm going to go on the edge and rock my ass around there like, uh-uh. And we, I vlogged it. I looked, I said, oh, hell to the <laughs> no. Did you know up there also, they have people go up there where they, where they get suited up and jump. Your baby, I was watch. I was up there watching these crazy people. Cause you can go up there and watch these people. It's, it's an elevator. This is crazy. You take an escalator up, and then you take the elevator, right? The elevator as you go up. There's a person sitting. There, All right, now we're going some some miles per hour. This is the fastest elevator, and such and such. They 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 get to talking about the shit. You like, damn. You get impressed because you're like, you're doing something that's fascinating. Then when you get up there, you see all these crazy little views. I'm taking pictures. I got this. I, mm -hmm. I, I vlogged this. And you're taking these pictures. And then you see all these little rides off the edge. I be damn. I ain't got on none of that. I ain't got on none. I ain't get on none of that. Never I wish I would. I wish I would. But I saw it. I saw it in my own eyes. People are doing it. I do want to bungee jump one day. But it got to be over some water. Ha! I don't know how I'm gonna do it one day. Can you swim? Y'all yeah, can swim, but skydiving, I can never skydive. Oh Lord, please help me. <laughs> uh -uh. Um, I won't ride the heli. I did the helicopter. Mm -hmm. Not in Vegas though. I did the um, helicopter in California. Can we do a meet and greet? We would love to meet you in person. Oh, Dolly. That's what we're talking about, doing like a little group like trip. I'm thinking maybe some towards the end of the year if we're going to go somewhere hot. And another place I would like to go is to wine country. If y'all like wine drinkers and stuff like that, I want to go there. I'm, I plan on doing a trip. I mean, I don't have to do a group trip doing that. But if somebody want to do a trip with me, they can fly to California mm -hmm. and... um. I basically can get them and we drive up to the wine country. That would be nice. Mm -hmm. I'll pick them up from California and then um, they can fly to LA I'll, or LA. It ain't gotta be LA. It could be um, Long Beach. It can be Burbank, you know, anywhere over there. I'll pick you up and we can go over there and stay in a little nice little area over there by the wine country, because I always want to be, always wanted to do the little winery. So that would be nice for people that want to like experience that. <clears throat> I wouldn't say don't don't come if you don't drink, because you wouldn't enjoy yourself. But if you like wine and like to taste little different things like that, and we can get a to, to, uh, we can go to a wine um, event, sit down, we can get a charcuterie board, drink taste a little different wines, you know, and just hang out up there. Um, I've seen people bungee jump off the rooftop of a student center in UM here in Memphis. 
when it was known in the university in ninety in the fall of ninety four. Wow, that's scary. I don't see nobody bungee jumping. <laughs> I've seen a bungee jumping at little fairs and state. You know they do that everywhere these days. <laughs> Excuse me. You can pick me up your way in California. Okay, little mommy, you can ride with me to California. <laughs> I'm like, all right, little mama, you ready? Whoever live here in uh, Arizona and they want to go on a trip, I will get like a little minivan. I'll pick you up and then like yeah, something. And then whoever's flying in, I can pick them up there in California. Then we're going to go up to the wine country. That's if y'all want to take that long road trip. It's kind of long, but I don't mind driving. I don't mind. And we could be doing a little road trip and having fun. <laughs> I don't know. I always talk about road trips and, and, and doing stuff like this. I got to I gotta one day just do the punch, make the make it happen. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ain't nothing to it but to do it. Anyway, guys, thank you guys for hanging out with me today. This was a wonderful Friday. I enjoy spending my time with you and cooking. Lately, I've been lazy. I got to edit videos. So I really need to spend the rest of my evening editing so y'all can get those wonderful vlogs. I'll help pay for gas. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that would be that would be fun. Little mom, we gotta meet before then. Because I know you right here. Um, good night, Justine. Good night, Louisa. Thank you for coming by. Thank you guys. I enjoyed hanging out with you guys. You guys are the best. Question. Uh, I wanted to send a gift. How do I do it? In the description box, in the description box of every video is my PO box. You can send a um, gift to that PO box. Okay. I've been doing good. Thank you, Aries B. Aries B, you gonna lie? <laughs> I'm always trying to make somebody go lie. You gonna lie? Go lie? Go lie? <laughs> Oh, look, look at Carlotta. I had the pleasure of meeting this wonderful, amazing lady. It's just, yeah. Thank you, Carlotta. That's so sweet. Yes, I ended up surprising Carlotta one time for her birthday a couple years ago. So, yeah, she had a pleasure of meeting. I know. I'm such a good person. <laughs> I had a surprise. I had to do it. So, um, yeah. Oh, she said she's going live. All right, y'all. Let's go ahead and um, I'm going to go ahead in this vlog. If you're not subscribed or following Bedspread Chronicles right there, she is getting ready to go live. And her commentary, y'all, is so funny and hilarious. She is really good. I love her commentary. She's one of my favorite commentary channels. So if you want to go and check her out, please subscribe. I'm about to end this live and we're going to go hang out with her, okay? I love you guys. Have a wonderful evening. And I'll see you over there in Eris Be Live. Good night. Good night. Bye. The, oh, Luan. Wait, Luan said, I never told you. What you had to tell me, Luan? I forgot you had to ask me something. Come on, Luan. What you had to ask me real quick? <laughs> I started, I'm sorry to rush you. Hey, Tracy. I, f I forgot we were supposed to be and answer her question there a long time ago. This has been two damn hours, and we ain't answer her question. <laughs> Lord, I feel so bad. But I, I'm ready to watch Eris B and clean up my kitchen, okay? I'm ready to clean up my kitchen and load up the uh, dishwasher. <laughs> and tomorrow, Saturday, I might go live in the morning. I should go live in the morning. I might go live in the morning. Have a good night, everybody. What she say? Good night, blessings. Good night, Carlotta. Thank you for stopping by. I'm trying to wait for the uh, and thank you for the super sticker. Thank you. I'm trying to wait for the tea. Good night, Melissa. I need your advice on how I found. Won't. Okay, Luan, this is my advice. I advise you to have a serious talk and don't get mad. 
okay? Don't get mad. Talk and let them know what you have found and you want to know if this is what they're doing. And also, um, you want to let them know that you are very concerned because uh, just say some things like, you know, um, <clears throat> This is not really good for the brain cells, and you're young, and you're in a you're in a um, in a place of developing and learning things. And I don't want this to stop your your learning. Can you kind of just like not worry about doing this right now, so that way you can put your all into school? You know, I'm just telling you, this is not this is not good for you. Just 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 say it like that, but be nice. Don't be mean. And 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 they're gonna and they might be like, okay, ma. I'm like, cause it ain't that serious. It, it. Good night, Miss Gloria. Good night, um. Everybody, let them know. Late to the part. Oh, we about to leave, Helen. So let your child know that you're concerned. You have found this. Let them know that you don't think this is the best thing to do right now because this this uh, it is known to you know um break down the brain cells and you're I don't want this to stop you from learning anything important that you need to learn. It takes away your memory, which it does. You're not telling them you're not telling the person any lies, right? You're telling your child what you need to do out of concern. What they need to do out of concern. Be nice about it, be understanding about it so that way their reaction won't be, you know, defensive. If you the way you approach your child, you want it to be nice but not too nice you know what i'm saying and let them know hey you know I'm, I'm i'm concerned more than anything okay but at the same time you don't want to be too brutal and then they'll be upset you know you know how teenagers is okay i, I went through the teenage the teenage years is very tough years okay as a parent so i hope that helped you I'll be praying for you, girl. You got this, okay? You got this. Thank you. Good night, everybody. I love y'all. I'll see you in the next video. See you over there in Aries Be Live. Bye.